Hello everyone, welcome back to another video lesson. Today's lesson for grade 5, chapter 12, lesson 7, three dimensional figures. Page number is 941. Okay. Before starting today's lesson, don't forget to subscribe my channel, Learn Math with Mr. Saad, and also press the bell icon to get notified for every new video. Okay, let us start today's lesson. Uh, until now, you guys took two-dimensional figures in which you were having just length and the width. If you guys remember, you were adding the length and the width to find the parameter and multiplying the length and the width to find the uh, area. Okay, But here, in three-dimensional figure, you will have the length, you will have the width, and you will also have another thing which is height. So you have three things here, length, width, and height. Okay. In every three-dimensional figures, we have three things here, a face. A face is a flat surface. Okay. You can see how many flat surfaces this box have, the top one and the bottom one, the two sides. And front and back so total how many uh, faces this box have here six okay now an edge is where two faces meet you know it have six faces so where two faces are meeting you can see on this one two faces are meeting let us count how many edges this box have okay one oh why I write six let's me raise the six okay one two three and four where two edges are meeting okay you can see here also the side one and the front one five six seven eight where two faces are meeting okay if you can see this one this edge here the top one and the side one so 9 10 11 and 12 so total we have 12 edges and six faces in this 3d figure okay now the third thing is vertex the edge where the two faces are meeting a vertex where three faces are meeting let me erase this first okay so a vertex is a point where three or more faces are meeting okay if you see this point the first one, second one, and third one. Three faces are meeting. So every corner is a vertex. So how many vertices this figure have? Let us count. One, two, three, four. Similarly down here. Five, six, seven, and eight. So from this figure, actually it is, you can see the front side. Is it a square or rectangle? It's a rectangle. So this 3d figure is a rectangular prism okay so the rectangular prism it have six faces you have to memorize these things because we will use it in the next questions 12 12 edges and eight vertices okay let us go down let's me clear the screen The same thing again here it's a rectangular prism the top bottom left right front back six faces we just count the edges and the vertices so 12 edges and eight vertices okay now what are the prisms prisms are three-dimensional figures a prism has at least three faces that are rectangles these you see here how many rectangles this more than three one two three all are rectangle here okay so if 
uh, a prism must have three rectangular faces okay the top and the bottom face we call it basis okay let me show you here on the next page we have three prisms rectangular prism like this one in rectangular shape triangular prism in which you have top and bottom triangles and other three sides are rectangle because if it is prism it must have three faces rectangle okay so three rectangular faces and top and bottom which we call bases they are triangular and cube you know it's like a cube uh, all sides are all faces are square okay the difference between rectangular and cube here all faces are uh, rectangular but the sides are square okay it can also be rectangular but here all faces must be square and in triangular top and bottom triangle and remaining all rectangular okay so here are some attributes you have to memorize these thing guys uh, very important things mark them and memorize them a, a rectangular prism has six rectangular faces 12 edges and eight vertices now a triangular prism it has five faces nine edges you can count you know what is an edge where two faces are meeting okay and six vertices okay you know where, what are the vertices like this is a vertex this is a vertex three uh, faces are meeting at a point okay and in a cube we have six square faces 12 edges and eight vertices the uh, numbers for rectangle and cube they are same but here we have six square here are only six rectangular faces okay so you guys have to memorize these things in rectangular prism six faces 12 edges eight vertices five faces nine edges six vertices six square faces 12 edges and eight vertices okay let us go down now uh, from here from the top from this one you have to see and then you have to write it here uh, this is a triangular prism you know the top and the bottom we call it basis triangular basis five faces and the other three sides they are rectangles okay uh, and there are nine edges in triangular uh, prism and the edges that from the vertical sides of the rectangles are parallel and congruent the figure has six vertices six vertices and so it is a triangular prism six vertices nine edges let us confirm yes six vertices nine edges five faces okay let us move to the next page again here it's a cube six square faces 12 edges eight vertices triangular prism five faces nine edges and six vertices triangular prism rectangular prism triangle rectangular prism triangular prism okay here and this figure which of the following we are using the top and the bottom the bases they're square so we circle the square and the sides are rectangles so rectangular down here describe the number of vertices and edges in an unopened serial box of course if it is box so eight vertices 12 edges and it's a rectangular prism I hope you guys understand the lesson don't forget to like this video and subscribe my channel have a nice day thank you so much